When talking about environmental issues, we constantly hear the phrase, think globally, act locally. But how is this translated into practice? Hello, I'm Cristina Argudin, a postgraduate researcher at the University of Southampton, and I will share with you my current research that makes a good case study on how local actions can address global challenges. Biodiversity loss and climate change are endangering life support systems, particularly in the world's poorest regions. For the last four years, my colleagues and I have been working in the Calakmul Biosphere Reserve of Mexico, which comprises the Earth's largest expanse of tropical forests outside the Amazon. But Calakmul, as many other regions in the world, is suffering from the impacts of climate change and unsustainable human activities. More than 50 rural communities live in its buffer zone, depending on the forest resources. Increasing crop failures caused by unseasonal and severe droughts force these communities to supplement their incomes with government incentivized livestock ranching. The subsequent conversion of forest to pasture creates a vicious cycle of unsustainability that exacerbates the already vulnerable situations in this socioecological system. But the good news is that nature provides solutions to these environmental and societal challenges. We have a vision of resilient communities living in healthy forests. We aim to facilitate the uptake of sustainable livelihoods that maintain biodiversity and enhance human well-being, whilst mitigating climate impacts. We also aim to assess the ecosystem health to build a picture of the long-term resilience of the forest. We are doing so by monitoring the culturally significant jaguar in collaboration with rural communities. I will now leave you with my poster to explore more about our integrated approach for addressing environmental, climatic, and socioeconomical challenges in this vast tropical forest. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy the poster. <laughs> 